determines everything, you know. Like, uh, I just, I think, it, I think it helps me actually like push my riding, you know, because I know that when it's when it's being like documented, you know, like someone's there with the camera and it's being captured. I feel like it's it's like that much more worth it, you know, because sometimes you know you don't feel motivated, but you know that if everyone's going to see it, yeah, you know, it's uh, it's motivation. And people can sit there and go, oh yeah, you know, he's a shelf or he's a shelf, but. I feel, I feel like everyone in BMX is a show, you know, like because everyone everyone does something awesome for you know someone else to see anyway, you know. So definitely a good feeling to get it out there and show everyone like the stuff that I do on my bike when you know it's beyond closed doors as well, you know. Like we're just in the ghetto shed for like hours on end to try and like one trick over and over getting smashed, you know. The ghetto shed is a dream come true. I'm more more pumped about the. The, like the, all the guys that ride there, you know, like we have this session going like down there, and it's crazy, you know, like someone does something, and where it's such a like a tight place, like everyone just like feeds off each other, and the craziest sessions every night, you know, like at a certain point in the night where I sort of look around, and I'm just like, this is pandemonium, you know, like everyone's just doing the, the craziest stuff, and and to be fair, like they, that doesn't happen at just the average skate park. And that's that's a really good feeling because I see everyone pushing it, pushing themselves, you know, with BMX and everything. And yeah, it's just it's awesome to watch, you know. So so yeah, obviously having the, the park is amazing, but having those people around me to share it with is just like that much more, you know. So yeah, it's definitely a dream come true. But the difference between Europe and American contests for me is like I'm not the best contest rider, you know. Like like I crash a you know a fair bit and put my feet down and stuff. In Europe, it's it's just about it's about what you can do, not not what about like, you know, like, did you put a foot down or whatever, you know? Because I have seen con like contests in the states where people have won doing, you know, next to nothing, and it's because it's a, you know, a flawless run. And uh, whereas when you're out here, you have got, you know, people going out there and doing like craziest like tech tricks and like, yeah, they take some couple of goes to get it. They're, they're judged on. What they did do, not what they didn't do. You know, like, like that's that's kind of how it's judged. And uh, and I just I just love your contest for that. You know? For more videos like this, subscribe to the Ally YouTube channel.